it's just Wolfie again, you know. I'm, I'm just, I'm a floozy when it comes to bikes, you know. I, I buy them, I love them, and then I, I cast them aside like a, a second-hand lover. I've used and abused them. I've thrashed them with an inch of my life, which they normally enjoy. Um, are we still talking about bikes? Anyway. So yes, it looks like I got away with my speeding uh, ticket because I wasn't speeding. <laughs> uh, I'll actually explain. Uh, I've MX5. Got, which I think in America is it a Miata or something like that they call it. And when I first got it, I used you know you got your average speed cameras and I'll be pootling down these 60 mile an hour roads on the average speed cameras. I noticed I'd got a tailback of traffic behind me and quite anxious to overtake me so I got one of these apps for my iPhone and actually at 60 I was only doing 50 and it's reading about 20% out so you sort of have to make a bit of a, a calculation I know 82 is 70 uh, so when I went through this speed trap three weeks ago uh, I looked at my clock and I was just doing just a tad under 40 so I sort of slammed my brakes on and I'm sure the police officer had a bit of a wry smile on his face and I, I can't, I didn't know whether that was because I've got you you bitch or um, it was why are you braking for you're only doing 30, I don't know so I did a bit of a, a test and sort of 38 is 30 so I think I'd only be doing 31 anyway at the most. So that's why I didn't get a love letter from the police. Yes, no right, most soccer fans, I'm looking for an adventure lid for when I go touring with my buddies in June. And I want a good quality one. I don't want to pay stupid amount of money, I don't want to pay £600, I want, you know, one that's going a little bit discounted. And the AGV and I think the Bell and all that are quite noisy lids. So apart from Arai and Shui, are there any good quality lids which are quiet? Or do I have to plump for an Arai or Shui? I've seen them discounted down to £200 and I'm hoping that's a genuine item and the way to tell that is if it's just an internet shop the chances it's a knockoff and it's a Chinese fake but if they've got a proper store um, quality helmet manufacturers check on what's being sold so I think you pretty much can um, be certain that uh, it's, it's a genuine lid. So, but if you've got any advices on uh, on quiet adventure lids, and I want one with a removable peak, so if I'm doing any motorway speeds, I can take the peak off. Uh, so there's quite a few that fit the bill. There's some really cool ones that we can't seem to get in this country, we can get them in America, which is annoying. But I've dismissed the AGV and I've dismissed the um, the Bell. I think the Scorpion looks quite a good one. But, uh, anyway, I'll be interested to know any adventure riding types who've got that sort of lid. Uh, what do you recommend? Alright, motorcycle fans, you take care. Bye bye. Oh, oh, oh,